Hi guys, it's Connie, and I am going to do a haul real quick. Um, this is not the thrift store haul. I will be doing another one of those probably in a couple days. But this is some stuff that I've kind of gotten, well, some of it's um, right after Christmas, which is taken forever to get here. Um, and some of it was just a few days ago. So, yeah, um, I guess we'll start over here. I got the envelope punch board, and... I really didn't want to get this. I usually like to make them by myself, but they've gotten to where it takes up too much of my time because you have to cut them out and score them, and it's just it's really um, time consuming. So I went ahead and gave in and am going to give this envelope punch board a go. I've heard great things about it, lots of people use it, and so. I guess I got lazy and decided to go ahead and get it too. <laughs> it just takes too much of my time to make envelopes. I love to do it, but it's just, oh, it takes too much time. Um, let's see. <clears throat> oh, yes. I got these off of Etsy um from Prairie Bird Boutique. Yeah. Um they are the uh I forgot what they call them. They're like the crinkled ribbon. And, um, I like to use these for my tags and stuff. So I got these. It's a light green. The colors really don't give it justice, but it's more of a lighter green. Um, that is like an off-white. And then I have, it's almost like a really light goldy brown. Kind of looks mustardy here, but it's not. Um... So I got those, and she also sent in there for free this cute pink one, which is quite a bit for a sample. I mean, it's a good yard or so. Um, and then it was all wrapped up in this white one, and then it had a little pink rose. I mean, she packages things so adorable. Um, so, yeah, I got those. And then I picked up some more uh, double-sided, um, it's kind of like score tape. Um, what is that on there? It's cracked. Oh, well, anyways, I got score tape. Um, this is the, I think it's the one eighth, yeah. Um, score tape, because I use a lot of that instead of glue. And where to begin? I don't even know where to begin, you guys. I got these embellishments. They are going to go on the book that I'm working on. I freaking love them. Um, I got these embellishments. Um, those embellishments. They're not that hot. Well, I guess they are kind of hot pink. I don't know what's going on with the coloring <laughs> on my camera, but I got these cameos. I had picked up one of those already, but I went ahead and ordered another one because I do love those. I picked up these jewel ones, um, inspiration ones. I love these ones. And then I picked up these, and the reason for is because I have been making my own flowers. And this is one that I made myself out of lace. And these are this one I made, and this one I made. And so I wanted these to go inside of here, kind of like this uh, pearl one is. So I got these so that when I make the bigger flowers, they will go inside of the flower. So yeah. And then these ones I just went ahead and purchased because I just liked them. And I liked the texture of them. And I don't really have lace to make ones like that. So um, I also got a few of the smaller pad um, papers. I got this one. Um, I got a bigger one that goes with this too. They call it Cigar. What is it? Cigar Box Secrets. But um, it's kind of being used right now. So, But it's pretty much the same thing, just um, by 6x6 six six instead of the 3x4s. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see this. One handed is not e easy to do. But uh, yeah, it's just. You have to excuse my nails. I've been working with clay, so I always take my nail polish off when I do that. It's just like old vintage styled paper. I love this one. 
the Indian. So I got that one and the bigger one that goes with it. And then I got this small one. I won't show you all the paper, but I got this one. And I do believe, where is it? This one is the big one that goes with it. And then I got <clears throat> the 6x4 ATC pads, which I love these ones. Making memories with you. Um, so yeah, I got those. And then... Um, oh no, I did grab it. Okay. <laughs> There's the other um, Cigar Secrets that goes with the little one. But it's kind of like just vintage -y and I don't know. I just love that stuff. So, and then I got the Perfect Prince one, um, the vintage. And I'm going to be using this in my grandfather's book that I'm going to be making. Because um, he was all about maps and clocks and music. And, so. and then I picked up the uh, Nature Garden one. Which, if I can get my... Yeah, there. It's got, like, the little fairies. It's kind of a whimsical, distressed, grungy look. I really liked it, so. I got to toes. I just quit your whining. <laughs> Goof. Okay, um. And then I got a bunch of die cuts. And I got this one, which is a flower. I got this one, which cuts the tags out. Um, I got this, these little die cuts because, again, I'm going to be using them in my grandfather's book because he was all about tools and mechanic stuff. So, And then I got this die cut, which is pretty cool. And then I got this one, which has the two different types of feathers, which I absolutely love. And then I got this one, another type of flower. And then this one is the rose. And then I got this one, which is the lock and key. And then I got this one, which is just like um, border, side corner, um, embellishment type die cuts. And then I got little butterflies. Um, and then I also got some embossing folders. I got the um, peacock. And then I got the Paris themed one. And this one is the graveyard and moon and trees and tombstone type things. And then I got this one that has the keys. This one that has a bunch of um, seashells. One that has the wood. One that has a bunch of buttons. Um, this one that has the tree. And then this one that has the clocks. So though I got all those. And then I picked up a few stamps. Um, I got this one, which it rolls to be, um, uh, it's called a doodle roller, and it has a bunch of roses, which you can do like borders and stuff with. So I really like that. And then I picked up this one, which is like, the border or top of um, a page that you can um, do the roses with. Um, <clears throat> I picked up this one a couple weeks ago, I do believe, um, that came before the rest of them did, but still. Um, this one is the Stampology. It's got like the uh, dandelions and, is it dandelions? Yeah. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> I can't think right now. Um, I picked up these, which makes, um, it just says, uh, so much to do, just a little note. Um, you can stamp them on um, paper and stuff and put them in junk journals. And then I got the clocks again for my grandfather. Stamps. And then I got these ones, which are books and pens and inks and, you know, all the old vintage style stuff. 
And then I picked these up. They are vintage tool stamps. Again, for my grandpa's book that I'm going to be making. And I do believe that was all of my haul for today. And believe it or not, the stuff was all really, really cheap. The only thing that was kind of expensive was the envelope punch one. And even then, that wasn't really expensive. It was only like 11 bucks. Um, I got these stamps, I think were like on sale. There was a sale going on. Some of it was um, like 80% off or something. Um, so they were only like a couple bucks. I think this one was like $4 or $5. Um, the I got all these on sale for $2 a piece. And then there was a code for it. Um, it was like 20% off or something, your order. Um, the die cuts were pretty reasonable. Um, I think the most expensive one was this one. And I think this one was like nine dollars or something like that um all the pads and stuff were like three and four bucks these were only a couple bucks i mean everything was pretty darn cheap even these um with shipping and everything they were only like five bucks or something like that seven bucks i don't remember so it was actually really cheap for all this stuff believe it or not so that's I guess the good thing about buying online <laughs> it's a little bit cheaper it may take forever to get here but it's cheaper so um yeah I think that's it for this video um I will talk to you guys later bye